And we're back in the game with some more Medieval 2 Total War Historical Battles. Today we'll be playing the Battle of Arsuf, so let's read through the description. Following the fall of Jerusalem to Sultan Saladin, the Christian nations organized another crusade to recapture the Holy City. Amongst the most enthusiastic crusaders was King Richard of England. Arriving in the Holy Land in 1191, he was able to capture the city of Acre and force Saladin to retreat. He then marched along the coast to the port city of Jaffa, which would make a good base for an attack on Jerusalem. However, Saladin's army shadowed him the whole way, and on the 7th of September, near the town of Arsuf, made a serious attack on Richard's column on March. Control Richard's army and fend off Saladin. If you succeed, the way to Jerusalem will be clear. Okay, let's take a look at our forces. We have a lot of heavy cavalry, some mercenary cavalry, uh, quite a few units of spearmen, some mercenary uh, missile troops and some human archers and Egypt controlled by Saladin there's quite a bit of cavalry too quite a bit of missile infantry and quite a few spare units so let's get started No enterprise is more likely to succeed than one concealed from the enemy until it is ripe for execution. September the 7th, 1191 AD. The third crusade began with the capture of the city of Acre, the ultimate goal to seize Jerusalem. King Richard, the Lion Heart of England, saw the port city of Jaffa as a vital staging place on the road to the Holy City and resolved to take it. Marshalling the Crusader forces, King Richard marked his son to wrest the city from Saracen hands. Shadowing this invading army from inland, the great Sultan and leader of the Saracens, Saladin, waits for an opportunity to strike. Saladin draws his army into battle formation in a forest near Arsuf, ideal position from which to launch an ambush. In readiness for the inevitable Saracen attack, King Richard's men march in a formation to allow them to respond quickly. His archers and crossbowmen hug the coast in a screen of cavalry and infantry between him and the Saracens. Saladin springs the attack with terrifying quickness, hoping to drive the Crusaders into the sea. Right. Let's get our missile troops all on the skirmish mode. We need to get our cavalry into action. Let's see if we can take out their cavalry forces too. We're in a bad position here. Get our spin engaged. I think we've seen all some forces there. We're chasing off their cavalry. Can we get you into their flanks with our general?
Right. Keep using our cap to chase off of this. Got some spearmen here charging the rear of our cab. Right, their cab has gone from there. Can we get into their missile troops. That's where their general is. My general is heavily engaged over here with some spearmen. Need to get him away from the spearmen. They've got some most of their forces over here around him. Our general is almost gone. Let's try to get him back behind our lines. Right, we've chased off their units over here. Just malicious spearmen, so I think we can break them with our cavalry forces. These ones are wavering over here. No, oh, don't worry. We can win it. We can win it. Right. There's Saladin. Can we skirmish him down? Certainly clearing out uh, these forces. With our cavalry units. We freed up some spear units. Let's get those over here. Clear out these arches. Yes, only half. Don't worry. What we need to do is get rid of our um, Saladin, who is over here chasing down our missile troops. He still has uh, a lot of units left. Where's the biggest forces? Right, those are broken. Maybe there's some missile units over here. They're still active. We're going to try and break those and get them off the field. Yes, it does. Saladin is well away from uh, the rest of his forces. He's losing some models finally. We can definitely win this.
do they have any more active forces? Yes, some over here. Let's keep targeting Saladin. Right. I think we've got rid of most of their forces. We've got some spears here, which we're going to get rid of pretty soon. Yep, those are gone. Yeah, there's some spearmen. Now uh, Saladin is still over on the edge of the map. Still being skirmished down. We've lost 85%. to see if we can get any spearmen to chase after him. Try to tie him up. This is the main force of infantry, which is now broken. Try to get rid of these Nafatoon. Get our few remaining spare units into Saladin. They're down to 94% casualties. Get rid of these. They're already wavering. Where to sell them? Go over here. He's down to ten models. Right. That looks like all of the units, except for Saladin. So, let's get all of our cavalry to charge him. He is getting further away. We just have to catch up to him. Yes, we are getting tired, but we're going to catch up to him. Yes, he's broken. Okay, take our units off of fire at will. And there's our victory. Yes, outnumbered by over 600, but we did get another victory. Enemy general has fallen. Dan was Saladin. Crusader Knights, that was a mercenary unit, looks like they got the most uh, casualties inflicted. Good for those. And in the next battle, we will be fighting the Battle of Hastings. So until then, thank you all for watching. And see you later.